Hi YouTubers, it's AJ, your accessories junkie. I have totally missed you guys. I think it's been three years since I did my last video, um, but I have finally figured out with my crazy work schedule how to do at least one video every week, if not more, um, and I'll be posting them every Friday. So you can look to uh, see a video from me every Friday. So if you have not already subscribed to my channel, please do so down below and click the bell so that way you're notified as soon as I post it. Um, so this video is about my top 10 favorite travel Amazon purchases. I am totally obsessed with all the Amazon videos um, and I am a prime junkie. I think I have more boxes that come to the house than the law should allow. I'm sure everybody feels that way that's also an Amazon junkie as well. Um, but I just really wanted to post my favorite in terms of travel and I'm not seeing anyone really do a um, these are the best travel purchases. They've usually been a blend of household and kids and just overall personal purchases. But I wanted to do my top 10 for travel. So for those of you that don't know me, I travel for work. Um, and so I wanted to share the things that I've purchased over the last year or so and that have really, really worked well for me. And so I wanted to make sure that I share them with you. So everything that I mentioned in this video will be posted down below um, with links so that way you can easily find it um, on Amazon. All right, so my first item, which uh, mostly the women will appeal to this one or anyone that uses a lot of hair products, maybe I shouldn't say women, that was kind of biased, um, is it's called Liquid Snugs. So it comes with a three ounce and a two ounce. Um, so we've all purchased the containers that say, oh, it's not going to spill and you put your shampoo and your conditioner and your lotions and whatever else in them and then you get to your destination after they've rumpled around in the luggage, whether it was checked or carry on and then you notice you had a leak, whether it was minor or major. No bueno. Um, I will swear by these. I've literally filled them to capacity um, and they do not spill. I've purchased these four four times because you get um, an, in a package you get three of them two of the three ounce and one of the two ounce and so obviously if I'm doing um, shampoo conditioner and then when I'm doing a curly look I have my um, leave-in conditioner and then I have my the product that I put in my hair and so that's already four and so I got a lot of hair two ounces ain't gonna get it so I needed to purchase more to be able to get the three ounce bottles um, so love these love these love these again liquid snug and I will post it down below my next um, favorite purchase from Amazon is called M square first aid it's like a little first aid kit um, but it's not the typical first aid kit so it snaps open and you kind of have like this little packet here Let's show you that see it so it has a zipper here and I just have cough drops here and so um, I gotta make sure the two because my husband loves um, the hauls the honey lemon flavor and I love Ricola so I just wanted to have a blend of the two so in the event we get the scratchy throat um, I have something for the both of us then in this big pocket is where this sits and so it has six different compartments um, I keep saying I'm gonna take a um, a labeler and like say that it's migraine or allergy or whatever I've not done that yet just haven't really made the time to do it um, but all you need to do is and I'll pick a spot that doesn't have anything in it you just put your pills or whatever in here and then snap close and you don't have to worry about it and then there's also a piece on the back and so you can just open it up it's not a huge compartment so you can't put much but what I have in here um, is so uh, I started feeling like I was getting sick and I bought some NyQuil the day and night the Dayquil and the Nyquil liquid gel caps and so I have enough for one day and I figured if I just put one day in there if I start feeling the onset of something then I at least got something to take immediately and then that gives me time to either get to the store or hopefully I'm in route home in which case I have plenty of things in my cabinet um, that can kind of counteract and attack whatever might be starting to flare up inside um, so then on the back there's also a zipper. I don't have anything in mind. Um, I like the fact that it's smooth and because that pill case is so thick, I, I like just being able to stick, stick it down in my purse, my tote, or my luggage for that matter and know that it's not gonna like kill whatever's in this back pocket. And then also speaking of that, um, as I stated, I do travel a lot for work. And so my next favorite item from Amazon is this filtered mask. Now, it's really easy. 
you can still talk to your uh, flight attendant when she comes up and asks you what you want to drink or eat. Um, obviously, you'll need to take it off for eating and drinking purposes. Um, but I love these. You can breathe. It's filtering out what's what I'm breathing in, etc. Um, and I've knock on wood, I've not gotten sick yet. Uh, but nothing's funnier than the looks I get when I wear these on the plane, especially during flu season. Um, people always look at me like, "Oh my God, she's got something." No, I don't want what you got. So I'm gonna wear this so that I'm get your germs. And I'm good because people are the nastiest. They cough, they sneeze, they don't cover their mouth. And, you know, I live on the East Coast and most of my clients are on the West Coast. So that means at least a four hour flight. That is miserable breathing in that filtered air for four hours. Like I refuse. So I wear a mask. Um, my next favorite purchase from Amazon is a mirror. And so there's, I know nothing special about a mirror, but this little compact mirror I absolutely love. And the reason I do is because it opens up and of course you have, and I don't want to shine that too bright, um, but it has a, a, a light to it. So when you cut the light on with that little circle, now I can sit here. Um, for those of you that like to do makeup, you can put your makeup on. I'm not a big makeup person, but I am absolutely a lipstick, lip gloss um, person. So if I'm on the plane, if I'm in my hotel room, I can pluck my eyebrows if I need to. Um, or I can put my, my lipstick on and I can make sure that everything's n nice and neat and in place and I have nothing to worry about. And then it's just really compact and it fits in any cosmetic bag case you have. Or if you, you know, don't want to use it there, you can just toss it in your luggage and, you know, you have it for when you get, your, just get to your destination. My next favorite purchase, um, so obviously when you're traveling, you want to have something to watch um, movies or um TV shows, etc. on, play your games. And so I used to carry a mini um, and I'm getting older. My eyes are not as great as they used to be. And so my company, the doctors I work with were very gracious enough. They chipped in and they got me an iPad 10.5. Um, and so uh, it also can serve as a second screen. So when I am in my hotel room, then I can just set up my laptop and this and this like dual screen function. Um, but this case is a, uh, the Rose, Rose Bling, I think is what it's called. And again, I'll put it all down below. And it's got like this little blingy, I don't know if you guys can kind of see that texture to it. So when I ordered it, I thought, oh, is this going to be like that gritty feeling? Am I going to regret this purchase and want to send it back or sell it? But it's really, really smooth. So I'm glad that I did get it. The thing that sold me on it, though, wasn't so much of the bling, although I do love my bling. It was the fact that... Um, if you have a pencil, like I do, you got a place to store it. Um, and that is like the ultimate for me because a lot of times the ones they like, or they go all the way around and then now your iPad is trapped and you can't open it. And it, with this one, it just, it sits right there and all I have to do if I need, if I'm in a meeting or whatever, is pull my pencil out and start writing and take notes and it's like perfect. Um, so I highly, highly, highly recommend this. I've not seen it in any other of the sizes, um, but I'm sure if it exists out there, Amazon's got it. My next favorite purchase is a selfie stick. Okay, so I am, I'll admit, I am not into doing selfies at all. I'm not good at them. Angles, yeah, it's not my thing. But when I'm on vacation, I always wanna get like the building in the background or, you know, the water or something. And my arms are short. So I don't know if you can kind of see that. I don't have long arms. So I'm always trying to do this and then my thumb can't reach it. It's hilarious. Um, and my husband just gets so tickled. But this selfie stick, it comes in a cute little bag. And I love it. And so I got the rose gold color. I think it comes in three colors, gold, silver, and this rose gold or pink. Um, but it's your standard, typical, um, it extends just like a normal selfie stick. And it's quite long. Um, you have your buttons for connecting and obviously taking the picture. And um, here, the little slots to plug your phone in, and then here's a light. But the thing that sold me on this the most, outside of the fact that it's really comfortable to hold, it has a mirror. I don't know if you can see that. So you have the ability to check yourself out before you take your selfie. And then you got the perfect shot. 
Um, and it's very neat, compact, and you just put it back in the little bag. And, you know, I mean, obviously you don't have to keep it in the bag. I do because I don't like for stuff to just be floating around. I like neat organization in my purses. So, bag it is. My next favorite purchase from Amazon is this travel adapter. Um, again, I travel a lot and I travel um, not only in the U.S. but also outside the country. And this is perfect. So, you have the... Uh, Spot where you can do your base for plugging in. Um, you also have two USB spots over here on the side. But the thing that I love about this one in particular, so one travel adapter or all travel adapters, you don't need 50 million ones depending on the country you're going to for starters. Two, this one will tell you which one to use based on the country. So as an example, if you're going to be in the US, Japan, Australia, or Thailand, you use the typical port that we would have here in the US. And if you're going to be in the UK or Spain, you just flip it upside down and your port is there. And it tells you based on what country you're going to be in or where you are, like which, which slot to use. And if you're anywhere else in Europe outside of the ones listed, then you would use that plug. So as an example, when I went to Greece, this was the plug that I used. And I mean, it's just perfect. Um, now I don't have to have five different adapters depending on where I'm going. I can just take one um, and it's just perfect. And like I said, it charges all my devices because I just put one base in um, to charge there and then two of the USBs for the additional things that I need. And it, it was perfect. I just needed this one thing and it charged everything that I needed. My next favorite purchase is this wireless portable bank. Um, Nothing's worse than when you realize, oh, you don't have the base to go in the wall. Or you have the base, but you don't have the cord, whatever the case may be. Um, I love this ba uh, particular bank, though, because it actually tells you how much charge you have. And most of the um, power banks don't. They just have the little notches, and you just know, okay, after four, it's down to three. But you, don't, you really don't know what percentage you're at. So for this one... It actually tells you what percent you're at and when you're ready to charge your device because most of the devices now are wireless then you literally put it on there and it will start charging your device so I, I really like that you still also have um, the ports here so if you do have your cord you can plug it that way as well or for those of you that don't have um, the newest phones that are wire, like can just wirelessly charge and you, you need that you still have the ability to plug in so don't feel like you have to have a wireless capable phone to use this you don't um, it's just if you do have a wireless capable phone then you have the ability to charge it as well um, it does have a little bit of weight to it just as a heads up um, but it's totally worth it and I've I noticed I can charge my iPhone twice and my iPad and I still have a little bit of juice left so just to give you an idea of how much of a charge it has and it's actually got a capacity of 24,000 mAh so it probably could charge my phone three times on my iPad once but I don't never let it get low I'll immediately charge it my husband says I'm bad about that but hey I don't want to be without a charge and it'll be my luck the next purchase that um, I love and travel with quite often is my umbrella. And so you may go, well, there's nothing special about an umbrella. And you're right. But this one is a little bit different than your typical umbrella because it's inverted. Um, so um, I don't know if you can see. So there's your typical top of the umbrella. But instead of this piece being down, it's up. And so it keeps the water from sitting in the inside of your um, umbrella and then, of course, you know causing a mess when you when it hits the floor and so i love it literally i don't know it's bad luck to open but i, I want to show you you can just open it up and boom, it's done and it's just awesome um they do have the long ones but the long ones are manual and not automatic just so you know and the last thing that i have is my e-bags book bag this thing is great for when I'm going to be somewhere and I'm, I plan to leave there and go somewhere else for the weekend and come back 
or I'm at home and I'm going somewhere for the weekend and I don't want to take a rolling suitcase, I just want to take a backpack. Um, you have a spot for your laptop, you have a spot, uh, compartments for your phone, for your passport, for your tickets, um, for your iPad, for your clothes and shoes. Um, so if you want a full review of this, let me know in the comments down below and I'll be more than happy to do that. Um, but I actually absolutely love this e-bag. So again, I will link it down below and it also comes in colors. I got black just because, I don't know, I, I like black. Um, but I think it came in purple, red, and maybe a gray color. Um, and they may have more colors than that. Those are just the ones that I remember off the top of my head. So that is my video of my top 10 favorites of travel Amazon purchases. I will link it down below. Um, and that way you have the ability to go and actually order any of the things that I've shown you here with no problem. And if you're on Prime, you know you're going to get it the same day depending on where you are if not in two days you'll have your product and hey can't beat that all right that's the end of my video i look forward to doing many more videos for you guys i appreciate the subscriptions the comments um whatever it is that you want to see let me know if i can do it i will be more than happy to and until next time bye